All right, all right, what's going on everybody? This is your boy, Wave God 19, AKA Mr. Movie. And today I am here to support my bro, the infamous Tobias Trevelyan. And basically he's gonna be showing you guys how he make his vegan dish, also how he makes some shakes, and basically how you guys can um, stay in shape and give you some help, give you some tips on eating healthy. Um, we got a lot of people in here. We got Do It All from Lords of the Underground. Um, got these beautiful, amazing people. Um, shouts out to North New Jersey and all entrepreneurs out there. Shouts out to all the black businesses that are growing. And just shouts out to everyone who's still out there gr um, grinding, even though the odds are against us. So basically, let's get into this video. This is your boy, Mr. Movie, and I am out. What's up, y'all? It's your boy Do It All, Dupre Kelly from that legendary hip hop group Lords of the Underground. I am here. I am here at Blueberry Cafe, Central Avenue, Newark, New Jersey, at my homeboy Tobias Trevelyan's Vegan Pop Up. Now, what that vegan pop up is, it's not just about food, man, but it's about a lifestyle, living a healthy lifestyle, man. And that's what he's doing. It's about community. There's so many good people here. This is how you do it, Newark, New Jersey. This is how we do it all for Newark, man. Tobias Trevelyan, the pop up. We got Sean Porter with the with the beard product. There's just so many great people in here. I want to say shout out to Blueberry Cafe, all of the owners. Man, it's just a it's just a beautiful thing here, man. And not only is food here, but it's showing us how to eat healthy, man. It's your boy do it all, man. Let's keep popping up with Tobias Trevelyan, Blueberry Cafe. That's the first off. You know, this is support. The reason why I started doing this is because I wanted to help people with my journey. You know, I, I, I made a transition from, I was eating lean meats and greens before. <laughs> but I used to make the, the best lamb chops, oh my gosh. Yeah, my lamb chops, <laughs> my, uh, my salmon, my turkey burgers. I mean, that, that was legs. amazing. But I crossed over to being plant-based, vegan, vegetarian. I say vegetarian because I still dabble with cheese. I might have a pizza or two here and there. You know, if there's chocolate ain't around, I'm eating it. I don't care what's in there. So I say vegetarian, but mainly plant-based. I realized when I made that transition, that was, it was like I was walking in the, I was walking like a, down a dark alley. You know what I'm saying? In the dark. And I, I didn't know where I was headed. I was just kept going forward. And there's all kind of stuff going around me and I just kept going forward and forward and forward. And I just know how hard it is to, you know, know what to eat, 
you know, to, to figure out how to cook, you know, because you've been cooking and eating a long time on the other side, you know, as far as your meats are simple. You know, I'm gonna make fried chicken, I'm gonna make baked chicken, I'm gonna, you know, broil some fish, I'm gonna make a turkey burger. You know, this is things that we've been trained to do that we've been doing for a long time. I'm gonna have eggs, turkey bacon, things like that. So when you come over to the vegetable side, you're like, well, what the hell do I eat? And how do I eat? So that's why this is the first of uh, many pop-ups up, pop is to help people, you know, have some more dishes under their belt, talk to the community. You know, this is a vegan uh, restaurant here outside Blueberry Cafe. We're naturally supposed to be eating vegetables and in life. I mean, that's just how we're designed. You know, we're designed that way. But as you learn how to uh, pick up more dishes, as you learn how to eat, you know, there are going to be people along the side of you helping you along the way, cheering you on. There's, yeah. a big community <laughs> out, there's a big community of people out here. So, you know, know that. Know that. Did you get a taste of that? Yes. Yeah, he came just for the, for the, uh, for the smoothie because he saw me do the smoothie thing on, online and stuff. Yeah. But um, we're going to do this cooking demo. I want you guys to enjoy the second part of the food. You know, food and family and music, that's my thing. You know, that's like who I am. You know, that's what makes me who I am. So, you know, this is like a being in my kitchen kind of situation. You know, it's always music grooving. There's always good food. There's always good liquor. And there's always people hanging out. So, you know, just hang out. Five things. Key lime. Get rid of that white salt. Use pink sea salt. Get rid of the white sugar. Either use sugar in the raw or dates or something like that. They got date syrup like that. And then getting rid of that dame, um, um, dairy. Okay? These these things, huh? The Irish moss. The minerals in you. So, I like to use my Irish moss. There's ways that people have been using the Irish moss to make it into cheese. You get the Irish moss in you. Either put it in your soups, put in your, it was in the smoothie that you guys had. I just, you guys are growing as I see you about half an inch taller, all of y'all. Irish moss, cause I like the paste on it. And you see the consistency of this. I get this and I use this as my wet. So we got, you know, a little turmeric. What I like to do, we go back into the old school. We get this, drop this sucker in the biz ag. Brother, brother Fluff, we keep each other in check. You know what I'm saying? The real beneficial right here. I mean, these is natural plant eaters. Look at this guy's physique. You know what I'm saying? This is what my gym looks like. So this is why I had to do it. And one of the main reasons why I need you guys to know why I did this is because this is community based. You're in Newark, New Jersey. This is the city that I leave, live in. You know what I mean? To see uh, the, uh, the way it's breaded. You know what I mean? That's going to give you that crust. You know what I'm saying? Teflour, product of Ethiopia. Um, there's, uh, there's about 12 to 13 minerals in this flower itself. Once again, an anti-inflammatory, antibacterial kind of um, flower. This is the flower that I'm using on, um, on the mushrooms. This is the flower that they use here. This is one of the flowers that's approved on Dr. Sabi's list. Teflour, Tef grains, things like that. That should be good. You know, and I like to just flip it around. Yeah, give me a little oil oh, yeah, there. Give me a little, give me a round of applause to Sean A because she helped, she, she helped me put it together. What I like to do, I like to give it a little salt. You know what I'm saying? One of the things that I learned, one of the big things that I learned is that get rid of that olive oil. I just found grapeseed oil. Grapeseed oil fries at such a higher rate. Right, make it neat. Oh, uh, make it neat. I know, I know. You squeeze your key lime on top. Make sure you get this in you every day. Thank you very much. This is an oyster mushroom bowl. Oyster mushrooms are the hit. It's so tasty. They're so good for you. It's so simple. It's hey, what's up, everybody? It's me. It's Tobias. We're at my uh, pop-up, the plant-based pop-up happening in Newark, New Jersey. And it's just an amazing feeling to see all my people came out. I uh, fed the community. Uh, people came through. I gave them some tips on being plant-based, uh, vegan, vegetarian life, I like to say, because sometimes I eat cheese. But um, it's been amazing. Uh, there was no dairy in this pop-up at all. We gave them um, alkaline smoothies. I gave them seeded watermelon. I made them fried mushroom avocado bowls. Uh, we had a raw wrap made out of, um, with collard greens. And um, it's just been amazing. I'm really appreciative for everybody that came out. 
to hang out with me on a Saturday. The Saturday brunch, we had apple teenies, virgin apple teenies. We had mimosas out here, fresh squeeze orange juice. You know, nothing but top notch, not to mention the three piece band, not to mention my brothers from Scotch Porter giving out the gift bags, and uh, my main man, Mr. Movie, out here doing this thing with me. Uh, it's just been a lot of support. We're cleaning up now, and uh, I'm, I couldn't be more more thrilled and more pleased with the with the turnout today. So, look out for my acting class coming down the block. Look out for my acting class coming down the road. Um, look out for the next pop up. Probably be up in D.C. or Atlanta or maybe Chicago or maybe a near city near you. But it's coming down the line. Um, cookbook is coming down the line. Uh, photography books is coming down the line and uh, just stay true to your core. It's been a true to the core presentation. It's me, Tobias Trevelyan, and um, I'm signing out. I love y'all. Peace. China.